plaintiff, Dranda Brown, says she knew the defendant when they were younger, and years later they reconnected and started dating. Drenda claims after dating for four months, she realized the defendant was selling heroin, even though he was a recovering drug addict. She's suing her ex and his sister today for stolen money. Defendants Kim Jennings and his sister Cheryl Jennings admit that Kim was a drug addict, but he insists he's been clean for three and a half years. Kim says that he and Drenda were intimate, but never dated. And they're countersuing for defamation and harassment. Start with you. I've been knowing Kim Jennings ever since I was six years old. He was one of my brother's best friends. Uh, I had feelings for him at a young age. Somehow, you know, uh, later on in years, we lost contact. My mother died March 20th, 2013. That's when I got back in contact with Kim because he came to the funeral. We, was, we spoke to each other, we exchanged numbers, uh, we spoke on a daily basis. In May, I made a trip to Virginia to stay with him from Thursday to Sunday. Uh, every month, for eight months, I went down for the weekend to stay with him. The fourth month that I went down to stay with him, Kim Jennings came in the room, hotel room, with a bag, with heroin, a strainer, a, a plate, mm -hmm. Oh, and a that. spoon to crush it. <laughs> so I'm saying to him, you're in recovery. Why are you selling drugs? Recovery from Why? what? He's in NA. He's a recovering yeah. addict. Okay, sir, you wanted to say something? Yes, that, that's a lie, what she's saying. I am in recovery, and I would never be around any drugs. What's she talking about? <laughs> yes, yeah, recovery that's Recovery from what? Huh? Recovery from crack. From... crack. she said this was heroin. Yeah. I don't use heroin, I don't do. sell heroin, or anything like that. I make meetings on a regular basis. You know, I open up, I facilitate meetings. Why would I be Yeah, selling? when you leave, yeah. you go to make your drug deliveries. Yeah. So she's making this scenario yes, up? Yes, yes, she is. I had, she's uh, scorned. That's I have proof. Wrong. I have proof. <laughs> I have a recording where you told me you lost $5,000 of my money because you got a bad batch of heroin. That's a lie. Why did you all break up and when? Uh, in October, that's the last time I of went down. What? Of 2014. Why? Uh, he came into the hotel room. He went to sleep. The phone kept going off. So I checked the phone. It was a, a text message from a female named Trina that he was also sleeping with. So I woke him up and I asked him, who is Trina? She said she wished you was here with her right now in bed, making love to her. Okay, who so are... when did you all break up? Uh, After that incident? Pretty much so, yeah. Okay. The and only, time silly... I, only time I heard from him was when he needed money. Okay, and the stolen money you're suing him about that happened before you broke up? It happened after. After when breaking I, up? Yeah, I, I got sick. Okay, we're going to get to the specifics. Okay. I was just trying to understand. Okay. You want to give me some background, and then I'm going to allow her to get into the specifics of the stolen money. Go ahead. Well, yeah, she's a woman hurt. I know that. You know, um, she started putting, you know, trying to uh, buy me, you know, buy me gifts, putting money in the account, you know, that she had nothing to do with. You know, we were never uh, in a relationship. We spent time together. I, I crossed the line, you know, at one point. And we, we did do something because I, I was friends with her family. You know, I mean, I told her, I looked at her as a little, as a little sister. She said, well, I'm a grown up woman now. You know, it's not like that. You know, we did what we did. So you didn't date from 2013 to 2014? No, we didn't date. I never you came. Said, yeah, yeah. You, yes, she did. She did come down to Virginia. Every month. Every month. No, not, not, no, it wasn't every, every month. month. What was she coming down there for? Well, spend time with me and, and have sex. So you all were getting together. Thank you. All right. And Not October... in a relationship, though. Got it. Sex. Good enough. October. <laughs> October of 14, you all broke up or stopped your friendship. Why? Well, basically because she started calling people on, 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 my, on my phone list. You know, okay. people that I, I attend meetings with, she's making allegations that I'm selling drugs and... All right, let's get into the stolen money and then we can delve further into your defamation. Okay, first of all, the agreement was I was gonna move down there, 
okay? So I said, I can't hold on to money because I'm a shopaholic. He came up with the idea of his sister opening up an account to hold the money for me, for me and him to get our apartment together. Mm -hmm. get, no, no. Okay? No, get out of here. I have all my receipts. I have the proof where the money was put in, what dates they was That's put it. in, and everything else. Okay, so what happened with the money? They took it. She cleaned out the account. He whose told name, me... Whose name was the account in? The, the uh, account was in his sister Cheryl Jenner's name. He calls me and tell me that child support froze the account because no, he man. owed back money and child support... That's not true. I don't tell you man. I, didn't um, I did open an account for my brother and myself. Mm -hmm. The only thing that she can do is deposit into the account. Yeah, she wouldn't do what, that, would she? Well, if she... I don't know what transactions yes, that, that occurred with her and my brother. No, I only you know... No, 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 no. <laughs> it was your account. It's my account. I only think what do you I mean have you don't the, know what transaction occurred with your the, own account? Okay, no. What I'm saying is the only thing I have mm -hmm. is the, my, all the deposits that occurred on that account. In your I account? Have, yes, I have yeah. that account. I have several accounts. This what are we one talking about? Account. You know the one we're talking about. Right. I know, you're, I know you're rich. I know uh -huh. you're big. You now good. you want to talk big to me. Good. Yes. Don't talk big to me. Yeah. You got several accounts. On this, <laughs> okay, on this let's account. talk about this one account on this, <laughs> that on, she's suing you about. On <laughs> this account, mm -hmm. I can only go by the deposits that were made to me. My brother yeah. had the pen and had the card. Mm -hmm. Whatever transactions that he had, whoever deposited with him, he took care of. Whoever deposited me, he didn't know who deposited Did you make any withdrawals from that account? Yes, sir, I did. Not How much, much was put in there first? Let's it start there. It depends on what the no, deposit was. No, 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 ain't no was. depends. Total amount ever put in there in life, if that you can I keep up in, with it, out of all your accounts. That I, did you keep up with that one? With this one, I deposited <laughs> about three or $4,000 into the account. Okay. That I into deposited. Your, yes, who sir. Who else would deposit some? There's, some? there's other people. She might deposit for him. She might oh, be accurate with so that. she may have put some money she in there. She might have put in there, so yes, So you don't sir. know what was going on with the account. You say may have. She might have put okay, in money so in there. Okay, so you don't know what was going on with the account. She shows me deposit slips for over $5,000. Over $5,000. $10,000 and something. What happened to the money? Sir? Sir? I had asked, yeah. <laughs> I had access, yeah, I had access to the account. It wasn't, it wasn't nothing we was going towards. The uh, reason we, when it started is for her to hide money. Cause she, she was getting, um, what, a disability? I she couldn't, she couldn't. Social got that, right, social security, all that, but I want to know what happened to the money. That's what I want to know. I spent some money. Hmm. On what? Huh? <laughs> Clothes. On heroin? Ain't no heroin. No, On definitely what? not no heroin. Clothing, anything that, you know, and, and I said something. Yeah, just about. All right. Was it money that she deposited? Some of it, yeah. Okay. Did she tell you you could spend it? Yes, she did. No, all, yeah. Every dime you spent, she said no, she no, it No, it was all right. It, it wasn't no stipulations as far as what she and how much. No. She just said she just kept putting money in the account. For our apartment. I have proof. That it was for a apartment. It wasn't for no apartment. Yes, it was. Well, we were supposed to be she moving in proof. together. All right, go ahead. Let's see it. What is that you're presenting me, ma'am? Uh, um, statements from people, then uh, texts and voicemails. All right, right now, how does this indicate this money was for something other than a gift to him? It plainly says in there it was for, for a apartment. woman, by the way, who you said you didn't date. Uh -huh. She just wanted to give you 10000 in gifts. Oh, gotcha. thank you. What is this indicating, ma'am? That it was, uh, the money was for an apartment. He said he messed up the money. He lost $5,000 of the money. He was trying to make the money back up and he was going to repay me all my money. Okay. And what do you have there you want to play? Uh, a recording of him stating how he lost the $5,000 and he was trying to make it back up. Sister, did you know about this? No, I didn't. All right. Listen good. I gave you almost 
lose my life savings expecting for us to be a family or try to be something as a family. But then for you to turn around and do what you did. That wasn't my intention. What happened, it, it, it just, you know what I mean? I lost the money. For one, I'm trying to get it back. Want to respond to that? <laughs> you counterclaim, ma'am, or sir? I'm counterclaiming for the harassments. I have several text messages. To you? Social media. To yes, you? yes, sir. All right. What did she say to you? Um, indicating that she's going to whip my behind. She hopes that she doesn't catch me outside the court to tell my brother to tell me that she's going to break my jaw, that she's going to take my property, that I'm going to sit out on a lawn chair. Um, it goes on and on and on and on. I have uh, messages, vulgar messages that she has left me several me times. Well, is only last smoke. If he hasn't already done started, because he's out there selling heroin. You better hope I don't take you outside that courtroom, because I'm going to break your you want to answer to that yeah i was pissed off for the messages she texted that's a, me that's the more polite way of putting it <laughs> I was calling to, I texted her she? to apologize to her, and she went off rat and raving. She talked about my deceased parents, which I didn't approve of. No, reverse my that. My parents she didn't talked about, have nothing to do with she this. She talked about my deceased parents. Who's a liar? I have right about you a liar. She says to you, Cheryl, I'm sorry if I caused you any problems. I just want your brother to man up and pay me for the things he took. And you respond, if you attempt to contact any more of our family, we're going to file a harassment charge. I'm going to have you and your brother pay me back dearly. That's none of my business. You're stupid for giving all that stuff. You really silly, B. But you with the wrong B. <laughs> And that's why I responded back to her the way I responded back to her, because she did it to me first. And there's several more behind that. Yeah, but y'all cursing she's... each other out, ma'am. And the defamation is for what? Well, by um, calling my call log and people that I, I make meetings with. You know, my aunt that's 86. Saying what? Year, saying that I, I'm, I'm selling heroin. You know, I'm, I'm smoking crack. And then I, when I go to New York, I... I People do favors for me for crack. All, all kind of sexual well, favors. Well, what we do know, unless there's some evidence that she intended to make these things up to hurt you, she had every reason to suspect that you were back on drugs. Also, based on what I heard you say, that you messed the money up. She had every reason to form that opinion that you were either selling heroin or you used it all up in crack. Defamation is someone making something up that they know to be untrue. This is her opinion. Mm -hmm. She, her opinion is that he must be smoking crack again. Oh, I know he's smoking crack again. This isn't something she's just created in her mind to tell people just to harm your reputation. This is some, This is her opinion of you. After you ran off with her $5,000, you didn't put your sister in this mess. Got her putting an account in your name knowing that you were going to rip the woman off all along with this dope fiend scheme you got going, sir. <laughs> <laughs> you off crack, but those are crackage stories. <laughs> Judgment for the plaintiff, uh, you, and your Anna. claim is dismissed for defamation and harassment. Ma'am, you all were cursing each other out. Have a good day. Thank you, Your Honor. You're going to hell, hell. Ryan. You already in hell. hell. You already there. Right, because I'm seeing you. You already in hell. Because I'm seeing you. You're a liar. You're a liar. You're a thief. Just like go, your brother. Go back to yeah, right. Harlem. You go back, go back to on his that's what you do. Trash. 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 Pure trash.